Rare card. Creative value seek fission. Okay, this is interesting, right? Because seek by itself is eh, but it can get bonkers. Fission is can be if you upgrade that fission is actually really good. Mm, too fission. Creative is not bad against the guardian. Fission is actually really good if you upgrade it. Uh, going for these early elites seems dubious. Like, I like this path where it's like one, two, three, four campfires, or we could do three campfires, one elite late. That's the safest path. Consider we have a fission and we took a lot of damage. Here we can go elite elite. Oh, this is a really good path. Let's do this. Old fission was terrible. Yeah. This fish is a little awkward unless you upgrade it. And then it actually is a pretty decent card. Oops, I meant to do... Nah, it's okay. I'd rather just... Yeah, I'd rather block there. That's perfect. So we already took damage. Streamline. Okay, we can give up the fish and get 10... Okay, so this is actually interesting, guys. <laughs> I don't know. I don't think I want to do it, but here's the thing. I took damage to get a rare card. Got fission. Now I can give up the fission, get full life, and gain 10 max HP. And now we're basically 81 HP, 81 HP. Streamline basic basic cards. I <laughs> I like the fission. I think I, I think it's actually very useful, if, especially if I upgrade it. But this is this, this is just funny. That's just funny. I like that's funny. I do, I do think fish is very useful though. You also gotta think about like the opportunity cost of that event because like you could have removed a strike so that I would have one less strike in the deck with fission as well, which ends up being kind of nice. Like rare cards tend to get better and better and better and better, which is why you know they're rare. Like fission seems bad early on because it's not. Doesn't have a lot to work with early on, but then that gets better and better. And then Act Three, Act Four, that fission is insane. I mean, if you think if we're thinking about Act Four in particular, fission can give you um, gets you exactly what you need. Gives you the energy the card draw for turn two or turn one against the elite or for the heart. It's very good. Obviously, it's very early to be thinking about that, but it starts here, right? If you keep the fission and remove a strike, that's where it starts. Anyways, capacitor, I think is okay. We have no orbs right now. But I, I like capacitor because we already had defrag, so for me it makes sense. And I'm gonna upgrade the zap. Now, actually, this is really scary. Because I don't think I could do this elite. I might just die here. I have a lot of life to give up, so do I upgrade the zap or do I rather just do streamline and that's gonna carry us? Streamline for now, defrag, zap next. We have a lot of life to give up, so that's what we're gonna use. Wait, hair like that? Yeah, my hair's always this messy, yeah. Cold snap's nice. Let me make sure I can hear my doggies. Well, it went well because I had life to give, right? Thirty, I gave up 31 life, but when you have 86, it's like, okay, it doesn't feel as bad. Uh, so we can go for an elite now, or we can just keep going upgrades. Our deck is pretty good. But this is preserved insects, so let's do it. They're so tiny, so cute. Oh my god. They're so cute. <laughs> They're so adorable. I does this, yeah, yeah. Oh, I, I thought you were trolling. I does this, yeah, it does determine. I wasn't sure if you were trolling. I shouldn't assume somebody's trolling. It's on me. My god. It's a second elite down. Not bad. 
Oh, you've had the game for a month. Okay, okay, okay. Are we calculating with Frost? Yes. Melter Static Leap. I like the Static. I think Static ends up being pretty good. We have Capacitor. We have Defrag. So Static, we can just carry against Book of Stab and carry against Hyper Beam. But right now, Melter's pretty good as well for Acts 2. I think actually we take like either Melter or Static because Leap, yes, it's nice. But we have like Orichalcum Cold Snap for our block. I like Melter. I think Static is just kind of interesting too. Melter for the carry, baby. A pen up here, too. Safe pen up. Ooh, okay, 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 okay. Hair isn't bad. You like the hair? Thank you. Well, okay. I woke up like this, but I woke up with a little bit mess here. So I did go, did the little finger, finger fixing, right? So. I'm happy it looks presentable because earlier it was like, okay, I had a little finger fix here there. <clears throat> beam so sweeping beam stack. I like beam so streamline. Sweeping beam is good for AoE, but I think beam so for the streamline feels good a lot of the time. You could also just from do nothing and you keep the deck small for the defrag capacitor call snap combo. Makes it look like Andrew Garfield. Yeah, I always get like I always get like all these celebrities. Like back in the day, I used to get like first it was like Michael Sarah. When I was beginning of high school, it was like Orlando Bloom, and then it was like Dan from Gossip Girl. I forgot his name. It's um Dan from Gossip Girl. I forgot his name. I've I've got a plethora of stuff. Somebody told me John Mayer. Like I, got a, I have a face that looks like celebrities for some reason. I think celebrities have this hair a lot. That's what it is. So Michael Cera was funny because I ended up going as like, like, like uh, Michael Cera from Superbad with the little bandana and stuff. Or from Juno, I believe. From Juno. Okay, sorry. Let's focus here. Beam Cell. I like it with Shimon. This game needs more lore? Yeah, I don't know. If, if you like lore, yeah. But for me, I like the way that this... I think the game is great at what it's offering. Do Beam Cell. And we need shooting me for this fight. No, we're good. Got pendant, that's right. So streamline is lethal. Maybe it was worth it to attack so we can get more pendant sacks. Like little things like that. <laughs> Glacier. Oh boy. I don't I, I don't go to the gym very often. I don't go to the well, I, don't, I haven't gone to the gym some time, but I don't go to the barber that often. Yeah, it's, it's I don't know if it's every five months, but as you can see, my hair is getting long, right? So, you guys remember the last haircut I got? Where I, I cut the... Sh shaved the sides down and cut it short? Yeah, it's been a few months now. I, I let it get long, and sometimes I wear beanies when my hair is looking kind of unmanageable. I'm kind of thinking about growing it out this time, though. Like, maybe not this... Yeah, I think I'm getting even longer. I used to have, like, long hair, like, wavy hair. And, um... I'm thinking about growing it long again. I think we can afford to do a curse, but no, I actually like having nice clean draws. Nice clean draws, yeah, I like my draws to be nice and clean. But I also like nice clean draws as well, so. Alright, let's do this. I'm taking a risk. No rest, baby. It's a calculator risk. I don't like this. I don't like this one bit. I don't like this at all. No, no, no. Not like this. This may be... Uh, we need to make sure we draw into... Oh, this is go bad. This could go bad. Oh, thank you. Alright, we're saved. Now we just gotta get our frost down and we, we win. GG! Now we win, baby. Because we have, what, six plus 
6 plus 12? That's good enough for me. I could do the Essence of Steel, so it's full block. But it's all good. I could do dual cast there, but once we get two more frost, when we, oh, there we go. There's two more frost. But I need to prioritize damage right now. And then we'll get the frost, because Melter's going to smack him up right here. Let's do this for more damage. Actually, that's not even more damage. They yeah, were seeing frost. Bam. GG. How much passive blocks do we have? Math? 20? Cool. I had to call out for math to come to me because math wasn't coming to me, but it came just in time. Keep the 20? Yeah, let's keep the 20. 26 with Orikalkum. Isn't it so weird how some decks are so drastically different? Like, I can wait for Pennib because I have Hologram coming up, which means I can do Hologram Streamline or maybe Pennib Melter. Pennib Melter's not bad, but I think this is probably the best play. Because you know what goes well. Bam, that's nice. That's sexy. Ooh, all for one fission bias. So fission, I got rid of you, and you got me healthy, and I did some elites. I like that. Got pretty lucky, I'll be honest. We got very lucky with the cards we got selected. Um, bias condition, I mean, focus. I'm all about bias, guys. All for one? No. Nah. We could do fishing again. That would help her get our draws. And then get our powers out. But okay. That's going to help me get my draws to get my power out. Like, sorry. I just, my head went a weird way there. That was a weird connection I just made. Ecto, Runic. I can imagine you do Runic, right? Is this a Velvet Choker deck? <laughs> nothing, nothing. Forget about it. I didn't say anything. Uh, We have Beam Cell. And zap as our cheap ones, and we have some. I, I think we can get away from choker, and this is gonna start affecting us. Act three and act four. It ruined me last time, yes, it did. But ecto would ruin me more, no? How about running dome? Are we ready for running dome? I'm ready. I'm ready. I've trained for this. So we want to do some elites. We have, um, I want to hit a shop. I prefer insects, so I don't know. Unless, unless I have electrodynamics, I'm not going to do that many elites. But we're definitely going to do sparkle and maybe one more. But I, I don't know. We got to be look careful because we don't want to, um, go head first into like book of stabbing and all that stuff. Our deck's not that hot just yet. RP run. Why? Why are we ripping? Why the hell are we ripping? Look at that. 30 block. No problem. Ooh. That's a... So consume is nice because we have capacitor. So we can do capacitor and consume. We get a lot of... I kind of like to chill better though. Ooh, hello. Nice little deck. Nice little 19 card deck here. Oh, wow. So it's actually pretty good that we get that. Because we can do, um, so they're not attacking like crazy, but we can get chill. Ah, so they didn't attack that bad. It's all good. Where's the show when you need it? Who's the one? Oh, this guy got strength. Okay, we gotta stop him. Sorry, sir. Easy. Now we get show, right? Show, please? No? Okay. Fine.
Ow. Ow. There you are, chill. I should probably upgrade that, huh? That's pretty indicative of me needing to upgrade that. Skim. Skim's not bad because you want Yeah, let's do skim. Yeah, to overconsume, I know. Ooh. Is this is this me should I just do buys now? We have defrag after. Wait, what are you talking about? You're trying to feel the same about what? How do you feel like upgrading them? Uh, I think upgrading one of them, it depends. If Echo Form is very important for your deck, but you're having trouble playing it consistently, you can upgrade it. But the better thing to do instead of upgrading Echo Form is to make sure you can play it and block at the same time. So you get things like Boot Sequence, or you try to get things like Seek to find it early, alongside an Anchor and Boot Sequence, or you have like Turbo. Sometimes turbo is useful to get it out. Because you can think of it as like once you get Echo Form out, you're gonna save a lot more damage in the long run. I'm gonna do this now, although I'm not confident about that. It's pretty good though. I mean we're feeling pretty strong right now. Dual cast. Either dual cast or zap. Let's do zap glacier. Is that a Hafu emote? Nice. Got a Hafu sub in here. Oh, shist. More frost. More frost. Yeah, I saw Hafu play this part. Loki, I was like, I wonder if she would like, ever want to collaborate and do the, those coaching sessions. Where like two people play Slay Spire at the same time, because I I never seen anybody do something like that in Slay Spire. Where I guess somebody has maybe, but where two people try to play the same run and they talk about it. But I don't really know her like that. Claw, cold snap. Hmm. We already have one cold snap and we already have glacier. Let's upgrade a claw though. You guys want that, no? Okay, let's actually think about upgrade a claw here. What, what is it doing for us? It has some kind of scaling, which our deck kind of lacks. We have skim. I'm taking it. I'm taking it when you guys least expect it. Actually, there's probably some merit for me upgrading. I mean, removing a card. Bullseye. Ooh, so we might able, we might able to do we might be able to do this. That was supposed to be English, but it ended up not being English. Whoa. Whoa. Okay, we might be able to do this against that gremlin leader. I mean, our deck is very skill heavy, but. Are we doing gremlin? We're not gonna probably get a draw. Oh, it doesn't. Preservancy doesn't work here, right? One second. One second, guys. One second. Okay. Preservancy doesn't work here, unfortunately. It does? No, it doesn't. It, we tried it, did we? Oh my god, it does. You're right. Your memory is infallible. I love your memory. Do we wait for. No, we don't wait. We wait for no man. We do strike and set because the damage is so important. Wait, don't we just like fire this booty? We fire this little booty off. Before we do that, we do this. And then fire pot. 
Oh my god, we got it. Pum, 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 pum. I think one frost is, I mean, one zap is probably okay. Just to get some, some damage. Ooh, we got biased. Ooh, you touched my tra la la. Ooh, my ding ding dong. And we thought I was gonna get wrecked. Excuse me? Ooh, yes. Excited boy. Camera's gone for just a little bit and it's back. Somebody had to come in the room. Double claw? Nah, we're good. That was particularly worth the camera gone? Oh, so if I had the camera. Ooh, you touched my tra la la. Ooh, my ding ding dong. Is it better? Card draw. Dreamcatcher. Do I want. Do you that back? Because we can rest, right? And get our uh, cards that are upgraded with Toxic Egg. Or we can get Sapphire Key right now, because this is not something I'm super happy about. Because we also already have healing with this. I'm taking Dreamcatcher. Let's go, baby. What we got? Easy. Easy. Mm. I need snacks. I'm like hungry right now. Do we do buys right now? I'm gonna wait with the buys. Now that's been a new subscriber. You can make that a subscriber and emote. Melter is pot shampoo. Bam, bam. Okay, that hurt, that hurt, that hurt. I see you. Relax a little bit. Relax. I don't have good AoE. So I'm thinking maybe now we just say, you know what? I don't have AoE. I want to full attack this guy. Give me the... Oh, come on, we got this. Right? Right? He's not going to kill me right now? Dude, you got to relax. We got this, right? Oh, I'm a sniper. Letter opener. Ooh, hologram. Boot sequence. Kabao's not bad for card draw, though. You're rich, by the way. Bam. 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 Oh, this, has, this guy hurts like how? Oh, wait one second, one second. One second, this guy is no joke. This guy's insane. I think we do biased. I mean, we, okay, so if we do block block, uh, we can we can hold off on biased, right? I gotta get a rest in. Hologram for our claw. Naturally. My deck's actually so good. Jesus. Stack. Are we doing too much block? Boot sequence? Boot sequence is okay. First turn, we're never going to take damage, but we already have show for the first turn. I can see boot sequence being okay. And what nice, what's nice about boot sequence is that it doesn't keep clogging my my deck with too much block like stack wood potentially right because it's still important to have a nice balance between offense and defense because you want to be able to hit things like reprimenter stack i can see stack being pretty well with hologram though ah uh, so we're gonna do that we're gonna rest i'm gonna do another elite that's another glacier my goodness gracious give me blizzard maybe now and maybe i'll take a blizzard Poison this guy in the back. Wow. They still got damage to me? Jesus, you guys are savage. Uh, I'll do bias. I should have done it earlier. That's my bad. Let's 
So now letter opener is pretty good here, right? Oh, the guy did it right now. Damn, because I want—I kind of want to do. Hmm. I want to do glacier again, but now I can't. I suppose we could do zap and get lucky. We could do stack. We won't take. If we do stack, we won't take damage, right? Are we worried about taking damage at all? I don't think so. We could do zap, but maybe we don't want to take damage. Do stack, just in case. Yeah. Over a bunch of block. Now it'll be a good turn for stack. But does not matter because we're about to win? Okay, not win, but. We actually had lethal on this guy? Was, was, was that just short? We're good. Not bad, not bad, not bad. Matryoshka. Equilibrium is pretty good. Are we doing too much block? I mean, maybe. Oh, we're on a capacitor. Oh my goodness gracious. Bottle lightning on what? What? What are you asking for? Nah, we do that. We're on a capacitor. We need, we need like... Something for the bias. We need a uh, artifact. Amplify. We have decent powers, like amplify for capacitor and for defrag. I think on the for the most part, amplify can be nice, and we have equilibrium, which means we can hold on to amplify and do amplify defrag. And I think I'll pay for itself. Is that a snap pick? A little bit. Another thing we could have done is like a remove. Um, I'll do this for another card. Darkness. Ooh, double chill. My god. I need AoE, so Demon Gloom is probably good, but I like darkness. Cool. So I want to hold on to the chill here. I actually want to hold on to Defrag for Amplify, but I, okay, th this is kind of awkward because now Amplify is just more of a dead card. This is awkward. Well, hello, Amplify. You're definitely not going to be played there. Hmm. So close. Yeah, Amplify was, was an impulsive purchase. I apologize to myself for that one. We do chill now, right? Chill now gives me one, two, three. Yeah, I could do chill now. It gives me two. Uh, since it gives me two, that changes my perspective a little bit. Just a little bit. So can we talk about how... The uh, Amplify was really bad. We're gonna kill Scout Dark? Ooh! Oh my god. Do we just do Dark now? That's like, that's 108 damage. Shit, that's pretty good. Amplify, you're so so bad. Oh, Amplify is gonna carry us with. I, guys, I figured it out. Okay, we're gonna drop ice condition next turn, right? Okay. We do amp hologram amplify now. Equilibrium. Check this out. Next turn, we use amplify. 
on the bias condition, and that's just gonna destroy the rest of the fight. It's not gonna even be funny. Like, it's disgusting. Boom. Game set match. Pendip stacking. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, check this out. We're one second away from multiple ways of getting lethal. Penib or dark. What did you what should pick your poison? This one? Okay, cool. <clears throat> oh my god. So fission bias hyper beam. You know what? Fission is very good. It's already upgraded. It got me this run. It's coming back to me for the second time. It's like, please pick me, Papa. I got you this far. Take me back. Vision, when you talk like that, I don't think you're my son. Wait, we can do bias cognition number two. That's kind of good, right? Mm, we do have amplify. This curse amplify. So we can do like amplify bias bias. No. Fission could also help us do Amplify shenanigans on Defrag. We do have Running Capacitor. I think this is pretty good. We're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. You know what? It's okay. Curse Key. Runic Pyramid. Oh my god. Crack Core. I don't like saying that because I feel like I'm saying Crack Core. Cracked Core. Okay. Cracked Core. Gain one Frost. That's pretty good, especially with Fission. Yeah, I know. I was not going to actually say it, but then I, someone told me the other day, politically correct. So I guess that kind of subconsciously maybe not be politically correct. Um, it's actually pretty good, because if we do fishing, we can re -get, get the frost. It helps with our block. We have Runic Capacitor. Runic Pyramid is not bad. We can hold on to all the powers. And we amplify willy-nilly and stuff like that. Man, there's a lot of... A lot of options. Five energy, go to pyramid. They're all very good. Take care, J Man. Take my curse. I, I think first goes actually really good. That could have been the game defining lost pick. Do have some things pyramid is nice to have. Because you can you could set up things like bigger bias and you know amplify defrag and that Ten times is worth it. You also set a multicast on the dark orb, right? So we can hold on to the dark orb and set up things like dual cast and multicast. There's a lot of things you could do. Um, I'm gonna do multiple elites. I'm feeling frisky. Wait, what? What are you talking about? We talk, what did you say, Trico? I'm gonna get out of here as well. Jesus, Salami, the way you said it. You're right. It's, yeah, it's time for bed. Wow. Something to say, dude? Did I offend you in some way? Yeah, you're right. It is time for bed. Let's get out of here. I'm kidding, man. Have a good night, man. Take care. Wow, the block. We just, we just need an artifact for bias, and this deck is actually out of control. Like, absolutely out of control. Give me Blizzard as well. Oof. Artifacts and Blizzard, I think we're done. I wonder if Rupert was better, though. Because now it's not like there we go. I mean, it got us through the early game, I suppose. We're running out of. We're good, right? We're running out of focus. This is getting bad. I could actually lose this fight. That would be embarrassing. I 
I suppose we'd always have that opener to back us up. Oh my god. Okay, I gotta put that push that dark forward. Push the dark forward. Oh. Wait, is that enough? Yes, it is. That's more glaciers? Jeez. Yes, that's charge battery plus. Charge battery plus is not bad. But more glaciers means we push dark like crazy. And, uh, okay. I'm taking the glacier. But charge battery might have been better. We're gonna do three. Deep breath, bomb, bandage up. I'll come back to that. The bomb, panic, manage. Panic button is very good. Panic button is very, very, very good. Because it doesn't work with frost. It doesn't care about frost and it doesn't care about ori calcum. So that's just like a 40 block. That's double bomb? Wow, they really want to give me double bomb. Where, where, are we going there? Wait, are we doing enlightenment double bomb? Is it going to that? It doesn't really do that much for my deck though. Like, Pentagon is very good. But... Do, are we worried about block? Are we having, I'm thinking about Pentagon because of Act 4 Lee and Act 4 Hearts. Having that ability to block for that much is very important. No, it doesn't. It only counters blocking from like cards, so you can get uh, Frost and Oricalcum. Well, I have Equilibrium for Enlightenment, and I have Hologram, so I have Hologram to and bring back Enlightenment when I need it, and I have Equilibrium to hold it. So with that, Enlightenment makes it hits the um, it hits the Glacier, and then I just can play Glacier all the time for one. And other things. And if I take the enlightenment, I guess I take double bomb. Just for you guys. I'm gonna spice it up. Just for you guys. Just for you guys. Thank me later. About to make it spicy. Blizzard is actually really good for us. My dog's at the bathroom, guys. Okay, so it's gotten really spicy. Really, really spicy. And it's gonna be amazing. And Blizzard would have been nice damage without any of the bombs, but my dogs have to use the bathroom, but I have to be here back. I'll pee five minutes. Um, I'm thinking about going for an elites, but I'll take my dogs out and think about that. Five minutes, guys. I'll be right back. Okay. What do we leave? I decided to get spicy, and I was like, okay, we're going to do two bombs in Enlightenment, even though I think Panic Point is very good for the heart. I see two bombs being useful. Enlightenment, I, th I think this will be very interesting. I think we're going to we're gonna really enjoy this, guys. <clears throat> is the hope. Uh, the question is, do we want to do elites? Right to mention, we were pretty good. Yeah, we're doing elites. You know what, guys? We're I'm not even going to think about it. We're just doing it. Okay, so chill. Guys, check this out. Chill into fission, right? Okay. I would like to get more card draw so I can actually have a reason to do enlightenment, but okay. So enlightenment doesn't get to do anything. That's fine. Whatever. Whatever. It, it was potentially interesting, but nah. At least that's a lot of block, right? So that's the that's defect. That's bomb. That's oh my god. I don't think we can afford defect right now because we want to do like glacier into cold snap. We'll get to do the bombs later. Don't worry. Health is number one priority. Now we're talking glacier. We do. Biased, zap, claw, and then we have pendant for the blizzard, and we just win. So the bombs don't, aren't relevant at all. So much for the bombs. I don't even know why I have bombs in the deck. If I'm being honest, they're just there. Why are they there? Maybe, maybe we say. I think we say pendant here. Actually, the bombs here so we can say pendant for the elite. That's why the bombs are here. The bombs here should be say pendant. Genius. That's why they're here, guys. I didn't realize it till now. The bombs allow me to pendant. Very nice, very nice. I like it. Quartz, cold snap again. FTL rebounds. Okay. I think we're good on the frost. We don't need a cold snap. Energy pot? Energy pot is probably better than attack pushing, right? Is it? Nah, because we have pendant right now. 
Pentum's not good for this fight, though. I was hoping maybe Reptomancer, but okay. We got Levit on the bomb. That's great. So we can do this. Draw one. Just just, just give, me, give me one draw. Uh, okay. Oh, Levit on bomb and Glacier. Hey, that's something. Not bad. So we're killing this guy with Blizzard, right? Now, I wish I had an artifact, but I don't think we necessarily care because we have... Because we have, um... Capacitor. And decent block. So we can do, yet again, another Enlightenment. Just to make this Glacier like that, and we, have, we can try stacking up the Dark Orb as well. Okay, so we have Dark Orb, Blizzard Scaling, and then we have Bombs as well on top of that. It's a weird deck. Hey! Come on, buddy. Come on. So we can just skim first just to see. That's, see, that's a one cost glacier. That's kind of nice, guys. It's also a bomb. I'm a little worried about this deck, though. We're taking a little bit of damage. That's not good. Ow. That's really not good, that damage I just took. Are we dead? Not dead, right? But maybe I should do attack potion at this point. We might be dead. How much time did he last turn? Uh, wait, we're dead, we're dead. Yeah, there's no way we're dead. Sorry, I, <laughs> I overestimated. Okay, that sucked. I didn't like that. Calipers is nice, though. Another blizzard? Oof. No, we're good. Calipers is great. More glaciers? Okay. Barrage is great too, but glacier? All this tech needs... I want to play bombs, but I want I want to make sure I block. All this thing needs though is um is an artifact for the bias condition, and I, I don't think we can lose. I don't see how we can lose. So this is weird, but I like it. This allows us to hold on to, uh, we have Calipers, right? So those turns like that are really important because Calipers exist. Now, Panda Point would have been nice Calipers, but this is good too. Amplify, we can hold on to. I mean, I can hold on to Darkness if I feel like it. Let's just play it. More for us. Ah, that was stupid. He, he, wait, what if I got lucky? He was trying to do the curse, I just stopped the curse. Imagine. I, I want to assume that he was doing the curse and I just stopped it by pure luck. Which is something I got to consider. I totally forgot that get those curses. I'm gonna assume he's doing a curse right now and we're gonna we're gonna go ahead and stop that. We're not getting cursed. That's did we really get cursed and I missed it? No, we're good. We got lucky I guess. Please don't curse, please don't curse, please don't curse. Ah, oh, we got lucky. Please don't curse, please don't curse. Can I just like draw because I don't want to get a curse? Thank you. Oh. Skim. The, the, the weakens are very important, right? 
Mm, but I think skim. We lose Kunai. Ah, uh, that's unfortunate. Consume? That's pretty good. I like having orbs slots. I like having orb slots. I, I really want an artifact ultimately. Because with an artifact and bias, I don't need anything. Because we have so many orb slots as it is. I think consume's going to be awkward. I could play it for one because of enlightenment. And that is a pretty juicy upgrading f focus. But I hate that, like... Yes, it's good, for, but the nice but these extra slots are not bad for me because I have Frozen Core to try giving me Frost, so all I need is like an artifact for bias, and then that's a lot of block very quickly without needing to do... It is very strong, it, you know. We are getting a little carried away, I feel like, with... I think we're a little carried away with some of the size of our deck right now. Although, Amplify Capacitor, and then Enlightenment on Consume, so that Consume is one cost for the rest of the... Okay. I mean, I guess I didn't consider that. Well, that's really nice. And again, we can do Fission here because... We have Calipers. So this is nice. More bombs. Non-stop bombs. We're gonna get all that frost back for frozen core, right? So Ah, you get these these are dime oh, okay wait. T frag. So this would be an interesting time to do like I could do I would love an echo form, right? We could do consume again. Or we could do enlightenment getting glacier for one. Now this is kind of just obscene amount of block, I feel like. Yes, my lovers, I did it I did it for you I did it for you guys. I decided you guys need to see some of that. Not enough creative deck building going around. Although it might be what causes us to lose, just FYI. At this point, I'll take another stack. Amplify defrag? Oh my. I'm gonna draw first. Amplify defrag is insane. I'm gonna get the dark scaling going. And then we're gonna just build up frost. We just win the game. Amplify defrag is awesome. This is awesome. This is awesome. Because that bomb. Actually gonna proc on an intangible turn. I could have considered that. That bomb's gonna proc on a tangible turn. But the dark is gonna kill him, right? Okay, next turn we hopefully get something for dark, like dual cast, please, please, please. Get a couple outs. Ooh, Potion Plus is very good. Okay, okay, okay. So, Recycle is interesting. So, I can start recycling the things that I don't like. Like, let's say, the bombs end up being weird. Or, consume I don't want anymore. I mean, it's also going to affect my draws negatively. We could argue that we have good draws, because we have, like, two skims. We have a Fission, and we have a Hologram to procure any of those things. But, the deck is 37 cards. By doing... Recycle, I can start getting rid of stuff like strikes and just keep doing glacier, glacier, blizzard, glacier, glacier, blizzard. 
Glacier, Glacier, Glacier. Like, okay, let's imagine we, um... Start recycling and we just get down to like a lot of frost and blizzard. I think we, I think we're fine. I mean, I would like to turn the deck because the deck is very large. We're a very thick deck. I wonder if recycle is worth it. I can imagine it's just dead all, a lot of the time. Do another elite. The lamp is okay here. We got the bomb. It's actually the greatest turn because I'm taking some damage here. You think it's worth it to do? I was thinking maybe do a capacitor. Maybe bias. Maybe, like maybe bias is fine. Creature's not bad. Creature should guarantee we're fine, right? Not necessarily. I'll do bust. So now we want enlightenment, guys. Check this out. Bam. Look, we, still, we still need to do some damage. <laughs> it's not helping our damage that much. We need bombs. We should probably put some bombs. There's the bombs. There we go. Say no more. All right. So we went in. We went in two more turns because of that bomb. Oh, this is nice. You know what? This is also very good. <laughs> Holy crap! Can we just win the game now? Lightning one more time. Glacier easy. Stack up Pendant. Speed Pot, very good. Cool Headed, very good. Reboot, ooh. Shuffle all your cards and draw six. That's a draw six for zero. This is obviously doing more Frost, draw two, and it doesn't exhaust you, keep doing it. But this is like draw six for zero, which may be important because. I want to make sure I get like, uh, Amplified Defrag out. Or just defrag out in general. But Cool Head is very good for consistent draw. Huh. I feel like that's, that's, that's perfect what our deck needs. Okay, this is what I was worried about. But we got Chill, Defrag, Bomb, and then Cold Snap. Oh, if I do this, I get Letter Opener. Let's do this. So the bombs are gonna be interesting in this fight. Okay, so I want to do glacier, but I also want to kind of kill these guys. Hmm. This is problematic. This is problematic. This is painful. So if I, I, if I don't do attacks, then I get Art of War, which helps me get more energy to do more like let opener shenanigans. So, which sucks is we're gonna ha we're forced to like. I feel like doing reboot. That's awkward, guys, because I was going to... That's awkward. Oh, we had the bomb. I totally forgot. Jesus. So that's... Next turn, we're going to have... Two turns, we're going to have 80 damage. Keep that in mind. So this is actually really good, like I said, for calipers. And now we kind of are in a great position. I want to make enlightenment a little bit better. Not that we need it. But 
just in case this was like the hard fight is what I want to do bomb glacier streamline okay, we, already, we won hardcore pen up sec you have any powers I have to play to get healing okay As you as you guys notice, more card draw. As you notice, the um, bombs are kind of unnecessary. I did it just for the shits and giggles, but panic button would have been a lot better because it gets out of your cycle. This, pre this prevents Art of War, but honestly, I, I think this is worth. Man, I wish I had artifacts. I can do the bomb now. That's actually, I guess that's, that's damage. Is that, is that the damage my deck wants? So stack is pretty good because we have calipers, right? We could we could do enlightenment now, get the bomb and the glacier cheap, but I um I could do enlightenment and get bomb and glacier cheap, but then I'm getting rid of dark orbs. Do I care? If I'm getting rid of dark orbs. And just just for the just for the just for the shits and giggles, I'll say. We do fission now. I don't want to hold on to these cards. This does give me like a lot of block. There's a lot of energy this turn, so it is. So I guess we could do this. So amplifies applying to what? Imagine if we get enlightenment now. So what's, what's up with the ha-has? I don't like unprovoked ha-has. Give me the heebie jeebies. Next pun. You said that I don't know how many times in the past two days. What's your goal, mate? Is this a joke that is this an inside joke that I'm not in on? So, we're, I guess we're waiting for Blitz to get big, right? Um, we can just start passing the turn and let Dark get big. 
I could just end turn the dark big, right? Like, I don't need to make them... Why am I doing this? I don't need to make this guy scale at all. Wait, I think we're actually gaining... Like, we're gaining block over time than, than the more he's doing. So let's just do nothing. I don't know why... I don't even know why I'm trying to do anything. Let's just pass. Let dark get big and we win. I should play bias before I left. Before I, should I get... That was my bad. I'm going to equilibrium because I want to hold on. I want to hold on to the hologram for the for the glacier. Ooh, okay. We can do equilibrium again so that we can hold on to the amplifier for the defrag. That's the top level play right there. We don't get Art of War here, but that's fine. So we get a bigger stack, right? I'm doing this so I can hold Amplify for the Defrag, and that should be really good for us. Or not. Or not, that's fine. Ah, but that is... A f huh. So I can do Consume. Wait, I can do biased? Biased? Biased capacitor. Glacier fission consume. But, that's gonna be a crap ton of block, right? Like, amazing sort of block, but I'm gonna start losing focus every turn. Can I win while losing that much focus? We have to let the bombs carry us then at that point. Because we're going to be losing... Hmm. Another consideration is that I just do defrag. Capacitor. Consume and then fission. And then we build back up the glacier. Don't... Don't, you know, do... And now we can do double bomb. Dot com. And when I, that's eighty damage. Okay, that's pretty good. I'll do this up just just because. But uh, we should that should be good enough block for now. We'll do glacier reboot. Interesting. Glacier. Equilibriums because I want to hold on to the sack and stuff. Next turn we have 80 damage AoE. At the end of the turn, right? Yeah. So now we do amplify bias because I feel like we're going to be winning at that point, right? I mean, if I had Dark Orbs, yes. Amplify bias is not bad. Vision is very good, I know. But I, I, my damage does feel a little shoddy right now. Until I see Blizzard. And if I see Blizzard, then I'm like, okay, never mind, we're fine. But right now, the damage is a little bit eh. So 72? Okay, that, that makes you feel a bit better. I feel a little bit better. I'll do this. That's 80 damage. Okay, and then, alright. Yeah, we can do bias next time we see it. I should do bias. Got a little scared. Another bomb. Another bomb. More bombs. And bomb again. Okay, we can't lose now. It's important that I play bias because I want to get the healing. 
Bias, where the hell are you? Okay, that little bit of healing is relevant. I needed it. Claws don't necessary now because we don't need it, but... Okay, the number one thing for me to find now is to be like... We need to find, um... Artifacts at the shop. Act for shop. I wasted Pendib. Ah, that was... That was an actual huge punt. Cause I need a pendant for the Act 4 Elite. Uh, that was a massive punt. I'm gonna li I'm gonna die. Okay, we'll probably be fine, but even that pendant was really stupid. Probably fine. Cause in order for to have a really meaningful pendant, we would need to. Be okay, I'm gonna rest so I can find potentially core surge. I don't care about upgrading any of these cards. Like, upgrading capacitor seems relevant. It's an extra orb for c consume. Upgrading bias seems okay. Upgrading Blizzard for the scaling seems really good, actually. I can imagine Blizzard getting upgraded is going to be the damage I need for both the heart and for the Act 4 Elite. Although resting does give us more HP, plus it also gives me potential to find artifacts. Now, is artifacts and that variance worth not... Okay, we gotta do that. Fuck. Shop, give me something good. That's an artifact potion. Oh, that's a storm. That's Vajra. Okay, that's Artifact Potion, first and foremost. Um, Chill's not bad. That's pretty good. I'm thinking maybe... Boots doesn't, doesn't... It's pretty good. What's he doing on the bed? My dog sleeps with me on the bed. It's fine. It's fine. More... St uh, uh, plated armor? Maybe explosive pot? I think Mortal's not bad, right? It's a defrag. Chill. Chill. Question is, do we do zap first? I'm gonna do. I want. I don't get Art of War, but I want to get rid of their artifacts. Do I have a weaken in the deck? I don't have a weaken in the deck, so the artifacts aren't relevant to me, so I'd rather keep the energy. So this might suck. This might just suck all around, but now we do amplify defra oh amplify How do we feel about amplify biased? I have really dumb this whole time I didn't even what if I do it hologram glacier enlightenment amplify bias glacier glacier Yo, guys, take a look at this. I told you this is what we're gonna do. Guys. Guys. You guys still here with me? I need to use Melter. I want to stack a pendant. Ooh. Ooh. Double bomb to win the game? Eee. I gotta hurry up though. I want to stack a pendant, but I also want to do mm, Art of War. Bomb is seems important. Bomb is important, but stack is pretty good as well. 
Did you prefer consume? Can't guarantee that I'm gonna get consume because it's all my cards. At least I get 24 block right now, which is pretty good. But we need damage. So we're running out of time because he has biased out. Fission. Ah, yes. Melter first. Fission. Oh my god. Enlightenment. Consume. Hologram. Consume. Glacier. Glacier. Blizzard. And I'll fuck you. And I'll fuck you. And there you go. Get wrecked. Get wrecked. Uh, I feel bad. Pendip is ready. Oh, perfect. All is right. Let's kill him with, uh... Let's kill him with, um... A bomb. Okay. Bag of prep. Oh my god, that's actually so relevant. Oh, heat sinks. Yo, these things are so relevant. It's insane. Now, oh my. Oh my. And we have artifact pot for the bias. I don't see how we can lose. How can we lose? We have artifacts. Okay, so heat sinks is really relevant because it allows me to play the powers that I want to play and get cards right on top of it. Never miss a beat. White noise is interesting because it can give me something random. But, um. Heat sinks is perfect. Yeah, dude. And bag of prep. Oh, okay. So we could do amplified bias, but we only have one artifact. So I just do artifact now for the bias. Question is, do we care about dexterity at all? Don't care about dexterity. It's all about the focus. I need something that gives me. F we we're gonna build up calipers. That's that's the goal. We're gonna build up calipers. So now we can start playing stuff. I'm gonna do the bomb. He's gonna do some damage to me. A little bit, but he's doing something. Seven, okay. Consumes nice. So here's what I could do. I could do hologram. Enlightenment. Is that worth it? Eh. More bombs. More bombs in stack. We're doing it. We're doing it. Although he's gonna start punishing me, right? I need amplify. Amplify, amplify, amplify. Ooh, so we could do fission to get the amplify before the deep frag and then completely win. And then completely win. Blizzard's still scaling, so Blizzard's still relevant. Darkness is not bad for scaling either. A lot of things I like to do here. Like, Darkness, sharp scaling up damage. Blizzard's obviously scaling. I think we do Fission now, but I want to do Fission after Defrag. Amplify is at the bottom of the deck. Okay. So, me trying to get Amplify and Defrag maybe is too greedy. Like, if I did its thing in the run, it hit the double bias, you can see lead fight, it's, it's done its thing here and there. I don't need to force it every single time. So we'll do, de we'll do defrag then.
I actually wish I could hold on to equilibrium. We'll do fish another time then. It's fine. I will start getting some darkness going. Or we could do defend fission just for the energy. Nah, that's stupid. I mean, well, we can hold on with equilibrium and I can get a darkness out and start restacking my orbs. I can wait or I can do it now. Let's do it now. And then what I'm going to do is darkness, glacier, equilibrium. And then Blizzard's gonna get pretty big. I would like to start getting the vulnerable on him now that we have Blizzard, right? Blizzard's pretty big, so I'm gonna start doing some Blizzard. I think our blocks are good enough that I can start going for stuff like this. I don't wanna let go of the breaks, but you know, Dark is still building up. Start getting pen stack more. Relax, boys. Come on. I know you're excited. I know. I know I have. Yes, I know I got bombs. Yes. I know we got caught up first. It's okay. Relax. Hmm, I guess we have to get rid of the dark at this point, which is fine. Where the? Where is my enlightenment? Enlightenment would be great here. I can put glacier, glacier bomb. Where is enlightenment? You know what? I want to hold on to these because I want to find enlightenment. Like a part of me wants to play Zap, but I don't want to get rid of dark. Boys, relax. Enlightenment would be great here. Wait, do we have? Where is enlightenment? Ah, uh, you know what we could do. Here's what we can do, guys. <laughs> Boys, please. You're acting way out of control. Do we care about the dragon at this point? No, right? Because we have Blizzard. And now here we're trying to get enlightenment. We're still trying to get enlightenment. Still trying to get enlightenment. It's happening, it's happening, it's happening. Oh, shit. Oh, my. Bomb. 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 Stack, you need, you need some love. You need some love, Stack. Okay, actually, I mean Claw, you need some love. But now we have no less, they have less energy. But does that matter? I should, I should probably keep Art of War going. But this is some damage here and there. Doesn't he start doing crazy amounts of damage? Like, when you start doing Blizzard, I'm running, I'm running out of time, I think. Yo, thank you for the Twitch Prime, Castle. I call you Castle. Is Castle correct? <laughs> thank you. Appreciate the support. Welcome to the Jump Hole. Nice to have you here. Consume? I don't think we do consume. Yeah, he's starting to get really strong, guys. I, um... I want to hold on to Art of War, but maybe that's not... Okay. Maybe Art of War was relevant, but I'm trying to do that for maybe for Pendiv on the Blizzard. Okay. Not that bad just yet. More bombs. Oh, okay, so now we have Blizzard coming up. We have... Thank you. Next pun. Thank you for the tier 1 sub. And Little Big. Thank you for the Twitch Prime. Oh, Appreciate it. Thank you guys. Get rid of the dark now. Stack up pendant. Okay, now we see Blizzard. Like Blizzard, how to get Blizzard? Blizzard, where are you? I'm getting worried.
He's not, hold on to the ground because we're going to get blizzard, right? This guy's not doing any damage. I thought he's doing damage, but he's not. The bomb is going to be pretty good, actually. Let's do the bomb again. Wait, double bomb. Why not? Who needs blizzard when you have double bomb? Because blizzard doesn't want to show itself for some reason. Yo, he just did how much damage? Wait a second. He just did a lot of damage. Luckily, we have tons of bombs. Like, but he just did a, at least 300 damage. Plus 50 strength? Oh my god, it's happening. We gotta win now. We have two bombs. Wait, we gotta win now. Ah. He's getting crazy. Blizzard, where the hell are you? You gotta hurry up. This guy's getting crazy. He has 70 strength. Blitzer, please. Okay, wait. The double bomb is not enough. I don't think it is. I'm trying to do damage, but... Are we dead? There's no way we're dead, right? He doesn't kill me. Does he? Like, am I... Wait, am I dead? Really? Frick. I should have done this earlier. Am I dead next turn? Am I dead next turn, really? Am I- am I dead? This is next turn, but like, it hasn't showed up at all. But should win this fight. He's doing like 1k? You need 700 plus damage. Yeah, the reboot made it awkward. He's doing 1300? Is that happening next turn? So if it's big hit, it's if it's big hit, we're fine. Multi hit, we're dead. Mega crits. 50%. You're telling me it's a 50% chance? Anthony, you couldn't have given this a fixed attack pattern? You had to make Rooting Zone that much worse? No, I'm, if I enter and I die... You know what? 50%. 50%, guys. Never not had it. I never not had it. Blizzard? You were just, you were just being cheeky. I get it. I get it. I get it, Blizzard. I get it. Oh my god, it was a heartbreaker. Damn. Scienceless, Rudic Dome, Double Bomb. Dude, that's a YouTuber. Say hello to YouTube. Okay.